What's good, YouTube? Your boy Bosco back again with another video. Hopefully, you're having a great day wherever you are in the universe. We're about to talk about some heat, man, some sneaker heat. I want to know all your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, you got to smash the like button. First question, how many people is getting 2K20? If you are, drop your archetype in the comment section and your gamer tag. Maybe we can do some things on the court this season. You feel me? First brand, Adidas, coming back with another classic shoe, man. The Pro Model 2G. Very dope shoe, a lot of colorways of this shoe. Let me know if you ever owned a pair and hooped in them. They're very comfortable, very light. One of my favorite shoes to hoop in as a child or in high school. These things are ridiculous. Let me know your thoughts and opinions of the pro models if you own a pair. Let me know which one in the comment section, bro. Of course, we got some Damian Lillard to talk about. He been doing this thing all year. Now he's coming back with the Dame 6. Not sure the actual release date of these shoes or the retail. But these things are pretty dope, man. I think this might be his best silhouette yet. The Dame 5 was cool, but this Dame 6 just kind of upgrades it a little bit, man. Let me know if you guys are feeling these at all. If this is something you would definitely try to cop for hooping in or not. It's like a low-cut shoe. You know, a stealth look to it. Doesn't have boost, but are very comfortable. The technology that the Dames usually use let me know what you think about these overall down below of course then we got to get to the king of adidas right now adidas basketball that is james harden come in here with the harden be4 now recently in some of my videos at marshall's we have seen the be3 which is not too cool kind of underwhelming but he's definitely cooking up with these be4s really dope shoe man these are the budget models for james harden so they might be like around 70 80 bucks something like that Pretty dope shoe, a lot of colorways also in these. Let me know in the comment section below of these colorways you have seen, maybe which is your favorite, and this is something that you might add to your collection for hooping in. James Harden is doing once again, of course, now the Harden 4 and more colorways. We recently saw Harden officially balling at, uh, what's that, UCLA in the Harden 4s, the Volume 4s. Now we see more colorways, more images. These things are looking pretty dope, man. Special editions, some collabs would definitely make these shoes pop. I'm not too sure who out there will actually get the Harden 4s to hoop in. If you own any of James Harden's past shoes, please fill us in in the comment section below. This is a place where we like to share the information with each other to help other people pick shoes they might want to get or maybe not get. All the feedback is, is warranted here. That's what we're here for, sneaker community, passing things on. If you guys have d details on the release date or the retail of them, let me know on any one of these shoes. Cooking as always, Harden is. We're going to slide New Balance in here. You already know who we're talking about, the one and only Kawhi Leonard. Coming out here with some shoes. Now he has a new colorway of the OMN 1S in like a gray colorway, man. These are not bad. I'm not going to lie. They're pretty cool. I think I'll pass on them. I like the blue colorway he had originally first. But, I mean, maybe these in person might do it for me. I don't know. What do you guys think about New Balance basketball? Comment down below, of course. Pretty dope shoe, though. Of course, we're going to get to the Dundada of Dundada's Nike. And they got some heat, man. The Air Max 720 ISPA. This is a unique-looking shoe. Two crazy colorways so far, black and white then all black, or white and black, then all black. Pretty dope thing, man. Looks like it might be a light shoe. Looks like it has some React Plus, some air going on. Not too sure, man. Not sure of the release date also, but these are definitely unique, and I wanted to get your opinions on these things because they do look pretty fire in both colorways. Got that whole React thing going on all over the shoe or the Element React vibe with a Vapor Max 720 situation going on. It's crazy what this shoe is. We got this one here, Jordan Pro Cho 3 2.9, 32.9. Not sure where this came from. It just came out of nowhere. Looked pretty unique. Looks like a 33 mixed with like one or two other shoes. Let me know your feedback on this and what these shoes look like. You know, they have the lacing system that's Jordan 33s do now. Pretty cool colorway, but I would pass on that. Odell Beckham's back again with the Air Max 720 in another colorway. I see the first colorways did kind of move a little bit. You don't see them too much in the stores. Maybe I have to look a little harder. But these ones are pretty cool. Nice, uh, you know, soft colorway to them. Tan with the white or cream with the white. Got like a cork type of insole imagery. Pretty dope, man. These PEs right here, the Y not zero. Point twos are pretty dope. PEs from Michigan. You know, Michigan sponsored by Jordan. So I'm curious to see what like North Carolina or somebody else would have and some PEs for these. But these are dope, bro. I'm not even gonna front. These ones, especially the yellow ones, are tough. Out of the two colorways, which one do you guys like more? And if you had the opportunity, would you guys pick either one of these? 
Next shoe we're talking about is the Air Flight Posit 2. Very unique shoe. Reminds me of some shoes that came out back in the day. Maybe the Flight Posit 1, not too sure. This colorway is definitely different though. Looks like it might have some weight to it. If you think you might want to get these to hoop in, let me know. If you end up getting them to hoop in, let me know. These things are pretty unique. Remind me of like the gloves, like a Gary Payton line. Something like that, you know what I mean? KD to the Nets. What's going to happen when it gets back? They're releasing the KD 12 TB in a plethora of colorways. I believe it's the KD 12, so they're going to release them in like 12 different colorways. I thought the TB stand for Team Basketball, but it stands for something else, but it should be Team Basketball. The red ones are fire. I like the red ones and the blue ones myself. My favorite two colors. But enough of that. Now it's time to talk about the man. Of course, if you follow me, you already know who I'm talking about. The man in front of you, right on the screen. LeBron James has shocked the internet, dropped some crazy things. Now, we talked about the 17 already. But this colorway for the 17 is pretty dope, and I need to know your thoughts and opinions down below. These are crazy. That Laker purple all through the whole upper. You can see that 2K branding. You know, usually on 2K, when you, you know what I'm saying, reach 99 quickly, you can get a shoe. I believe last year or two years ago was a Kyrie. Not sure what they did for 2K19. But these ones, if, they, if that's what you get for being 99 and 2K, 20, I don't know. I might have to go after that, man. That, that's fire. What do you guys think about those in the comment section below as well as everything else in this video? Hopefully, you guys did enjoy it. Leave a like. Leave a comment. If you happen to be new, you got to subscribe to the channel. What are you waiting for? Subscribe. Turn on notifications on to be updated every single time I upload a video. Spam the comment section. Team Bosco. Bosco Squad. Boss Squad. Boss Crew. Whatever you want to do, man. Hashtag it. Let me know you came early as you can. Maybe not everybody can watch it right when I drop it. But at least as soon as you see the notification, you jumped on the video and watched it, left a comment, left some feedback. Let me know you did that, man. We about to start doing notification shout outs. So shout out to everybody who is watching. Shout out to everybody who is spamming the like button. And without further ado, we about to get out of here. Have a great day wherever you are in the universe. And I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. And on that 2K20, you dig? Peace.